Hey guys, welcome back to the channel and today we are going to be looking at Nike trainers. It has been over a year. I have boxes upon boxes to show you guys. So let's get into this video. We're going to kick it off big. We're going to start off with the Nike Court Majestics. Now these ones I don't have a box for, but these are the Nike Court Majestics. They're just plain white with black leather. They are engineered for endurance. They are inspired by like the court and you know, they're perfect for casual wear and they're just a timeless look overall. You know what? I really like these, although the one thing I don't like about them is that they do squeak. So I don't like that and they squeak when I kind of move with them. But other than that, really great comfort. Do love these on, you know, you can't go wrong with a white trainer with the black Nike logo. I think it looks very classy, timeless, and it is very casual as well. And it's very comfortable for a casual shoe. You want comfort, so these will do you really well. Chef's kiss to the Majestics because they're rocking it. All right, so the next one that I have up that I want to show is a classic. It is the Nike Air Max, but these are the sequin edition. So they look like this. I just hit myself in the face. Look like this fresh in the box. They are like a gray with a neon volt green and a little bit of black on there. So really nice primer colors. It also has the air at the back, which is a great shock absorber for the foot. So if you're running, these are really good. Runners love these. They're really great for like athletics. If you wanna go the extra mile, these Nike Air Max really do stand out and hold their own. The Nike Air Max sequin is known for lending more support throughout the whole foot, which is really great. And you know, you need that kind of support when you're running. The engineered knit up here is stretchy and supportive as well. So it just, it's a really great trainer if you want to run. You know, you got the shock absorber at the back, which is really good. So when you're really making those leaps and bounds with running, this will keep you going for longer. It's built for endurance, it's built to give you the extra mile. So if you need something like that for the gym or like running like cross country, these are great. Go get these. All right, guys. So next up is the ultimate dad trainer. This is the king of dad trainers. In my eyes, stylish, comfortable, getting your kids to school. You know, it's that kind of vibe, to be honest. It has to be the Air Monarchs number four. I love these. It's a chunky shoe, very 90s, very classic 90s dad shoe. The Air Monarch four is just a really great chunky shoe. It is built for everyday endurance, everyday activities. You know, it's giving you a flashback to the 90s, I think as well. Like it's a 90s shoe. Like this is what I remember seeing in shoe stores in the 90s. It, it's just gonna literally get you going from A to B, to C, to D, to E, to the e, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, P, Q, R, S, T, U, Z. Yeah, I skipped a few, but it will get you from A to Z. That is the Nike Air Monarchs number four. Do highly suggest looking out for these. All right, so next up, we have a classic. Now this one is a 90s throwback that has been reinvented, brought back to the future with an upgraded twist. And these, of course, are the beautiful Skylon 2. Now, you know, I already have a pair of these from last year. But let me tell you guys, Lady Look was on my side because I found these in my size. That was all that was left was these in my size, which was a size nine. So you have the cream suede finish here. You have this black current type kind of fade gradient going into pink. And then you have the blue tick as well as the underline of the Skylon as well. And the Nike Air at the back in that color. So this is these ones. So I did in fact buy two sets of this Skylons. So you can see here, I have one for my collection and then one to wear right now. Like this shoe is so comfortable. I love this. It's got a really nice comfort to it. Although it's more of like a fashion style piece, I would say it's not anything geared towards running. It's more of a casual wear. These with some like classic, like light wash jeans really nice look for summer and that's probably the most time i'll probably wear these ones in summertime but yeah it's just standard really great quality you know it's got a good heel on it as well so it's a good shock absorber for all those steps you might take and it's definitely a sunny day type of shoe i'm gonna get two of this one because 
I want it. I got it. I want it. I got it. <laughs> uh, Ariana Grande's Seven Rings. Life anthem we should not all listen to. Classic 90s throwback with a 2020 twist. Now last but not least, these are my Nike Tabas. I showcased these a long time ago. <laughs> this is what they look like now. One of the heel is actually ripped. I don't know if you can see it in there, but it's ripped here and it's starting to make the back of my heel bleed and I was really kind of annoyed because I love these trainers. I wear them to the gym even though they're not really geared towards gym. Well, they're not really geared towards running, but I use them in the gym because I, I think they're such a, a quality piece of trainer. And I was just gutted because I couldn't find any more of these anywhere in the same color. But then one late night on eBay and I couldn't sleep, I actually found these brand new. <laughs> the person who was selling them said they were worn like a handful of times, but they didn't like them. So I snagged these bad boys, like literally hardly worn compared to mine <laughs> so yeah these will last me probably another five years so that's really good to have I had to replace them love them so much if you do see the Nike Tavas get them because they are a really great I think gym shoe not for like athletic running but still it is very comfortable it just I don't know if it's my foot the best out of all these trainers, it's my go-to one. I do have them in some other colors as well. And I'll continue to collect them as long as I can find them. That's pretty much it, guys. That is my Nike haul for up to now, I guess. So guys, yeah, like I said, that's it. This is my Nike trainer haul. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you'd like to see more trainer haul videos or more footwear of even like smart shoes, leave a comment down below. Let me know what you think. I'm open to all suggestions and make sure to smash the like button if you like this video. If you wanna help the channel grow, smash the like button, hit the subscribe button, turn that notification bell on so that you are notified whenever I upload any new content. I hope you guys are doing good, I hope you're keeping safe, and yeah, until next time guys, I hope you have an awesome day wherever you may be. Until next time, bye bye so the video you're just watching has just ended, but don't worry, you can go watch one of my old videos right here, or you can go and subscribe right here, and be notified when my next video comes out so you don't have to miss any of the action. So thank you, and goodbye.